Uh, my name is Laverne Shep, and uh, our farm name is LNS Farms. Uh, currently, we're milking about 118 cows. Uh, we have about 150 total with dry cows and everything. Uh, cow traffic that we have is uh, milk first. Uh, the reason for us switching to the robotic system, we were currently in a stanchion barn. We've looked at uh, parlor setups, and I never could see an advantage as far as our big thing was labor or saving time. And until we saw a few farms with the robotic system, we felt as though that was the route to go, mainly for labor, the reason why we did that. Well, the VMS, after seeing how they op operated, uh, I could see it did a decent job of milking, um, so I wasn't worried about the milking procedure part. I guess the main thing I'm, after looking at the systems, as long as you set up your cow flows and that right, I, I could see it would work. So I guess that's the reason why we went with the VMS. Yeah, from going from the stanchion barn to the VMS, we definitely went up in milk production. I, I currently, right now, I'd say we're 15 pounds per cow up. You know, it's two years since we've started now. Our average milkings per day for the whole herd is 2.7 right now. And uh, like the production for the cow is uh, we're at a little over 76 pounds. The, the average milk that can be harvested today per machine for us right now uh, anywhere between 4,200 to 4,500 pounds. The VMS that, that that's helping us with our labor situation, we always had part-time help for milking. I, we currently eliminated all that help, so it's just myself taking care of the whole herd. So I definitely can see advantage right away with not paying that you know help out every month you know for labor. And then besides you know that product you know that part of it. And then the production going up and the herd health itself seems to be a lot better. I definitely see the payoff sooner than, you know, than what you expect. I guess what I, you know, my big thing was the labor, getting these things. And I guess now the way I look at it, versus having four or five employees, I actually have 120 employees and they're all cows. So them are my employees now and if there's a cow that doesn't fit, that she might be gone, but they adjust to this very well. So. I, even when we uh, started up, I only had to sell two cows when we had to start up. And it wasn't, one was because it was an older cow, and one was just a young, you know, younger cow that just didn't adjust. But I mean, it's amazing how the cows adjusted to it. So, I, I guess, yeah. <laughs> if somebody would ask me if I recommend them to other farmers, it's almost a no-brainer. I, yeah, definitely I'd recommend them. Um, Honestly, you know, if somebody's thinking about putting a parlor, and I can understand if you have plenty of help and you can always get the help, you know, it, it might be the way to go. But I, for the future, I see this not ever changing. I mean, this is the way to go, definitely.